Breaking news to tell you about that happened overnight. A Chicago City snowplow crashes into another car. Let's go right now to CBS 2's Asal Rezai. She's live in the Streetside studio with the very latest on this story. Yeah, Suzanne, we're getting new information from Chicago police regarding this crash that happened just a few blocks away on State and Roosevelt in the loop. You can see the car very badly damaged, the snowplow there up against a wall. A crew, emergency responders on the scene, rescuing a victim from the car there. Police tell us that the car was heading westbound on Roosevelt and failed to obey traffic signals. That's when they smashed into that city plow truck. We're told the impact caused the plow to jump the curb and hit a large fence. Emergency responders on scene, but there's no indication, indication rather, of how fast that driver might have been going, but they were hurt pretty badly. Police say they were taken to the hospital with a broken leg. I do want to add, just in talking to public works departments in the suburbs and in the city, one message they really put out to drivers during this time of year where we are having winter weather on and off is that we really have to make sure we're keeping our distance from those city plow trucks when we are out on the roads. For now, investigation still continuing into that crash. We're told that both the drivers in that crash were taken to the hospital are in fair condition. I'm live in the Streetside Studio, Asal Rezai, CBS 2 News. Thank you, Asal.